this is it. I have reached 215 pounds. Exactly. Which is nuts. A lot of what I do is kind of built in now. It's, my brain's kind of rewired towards this new lifestyle. And so you can see the time lapse of my neck and my face going like this and getting smaller. And uh, mostly I want to see that for myself, to be honest with you. And, and watch that scale go from 269 all the way down to 215. Um, it just feels good. It feels exciting. Hey there. How are you? My name is Dennis. I've been overweight for most of my adult life. Earlier this week, I made the decision to adopt a keto or ketogenic diet. Starting weight here was 270, 269, somewhere in there. Um, weight today, 263 to 264. Not as significant as week one, um, but I did put down another two pounds. So a total of seven pounds now in two weeks, I think is uh, fairly respectable, considering the only thing I did was change what I eat and how I eat. I feel different. Uh, I feel great, as a matter of fact. This morning, I am down to 255.8. So this is the standard breakfast that I have been eating pretty much every day for a month now. This is the first um, serious lifestyle change uh, that I have made in, in quite a long time. So 2.2 pounds. Um, I should be happy about that, and uh, and, and I guess uh, you know on a, on a basic level I am, but I thought I was going to have a big week. I've lost 17 pounds since I started this six weeks ago. I am being told by family and coworkers that I look different. In week seven, I lost 4.8 pounds. Every possible thing that could have happened to try and throw off my diet and weight loss happened. Cravings for bread, for pasta, for the stuff that, you know, oh, come on, this stuff's so good. A, a cookie, for God's sakes. I would love to have a cookie. I'd love to have a bag of M&Ms, you know. And I've been also uh, engaging in intermittent fasting. I don't know if I mentioned that, but I've been doing that for almost two weeks now. Get something to work and then try to find a way to change it just enough so that it confuses my body and and maybe uh, jump starts a little extra uh, fat burning. I'm getting to a point where every single week I'm kind of bracing for um, a plateau or a gain and uh, mm -hmm. honestly it hasn't happened. I'm still feeling good, feel great. I was uh, outside working uh, yesterday in the front yard. I'm, I'm always thinking about how to get that extra fat in. And you've heard me talk about weeks where the protein is just so freaking high and how do I get more fat in In three months, I have lost 33 pounds in three months. This was a big week, I just weighed in. Literally could not have expected uh, the results that I just saw. So 4.8 pounds. I always think it's gonna be a plateau. I always think it's gonna be a weight gain. I'm always, frustrated and, and, and worried and nervous and sure that this is not going to be the week uh, that goes my way. I don't know if it's fair to say that the plateau is upon me. Uh, week 14, I only lost basically half a pound. I think what that means is I'm going to have to fight for every single pound uh, from here on out. 15 weeks ago, I decided that I needed to lose a lot of weight. I have reached my stretch goal, 225. Buh. <laughs> Going into keto, having absolutely no idea if this would work or not. I'm glad to report that so far, as we continue, it's working. I feel like over the last four months, I've worked hard for, for this. I've worked hard for this changed body of mine. I have to go clothes shopping. I don't even know what size pants I wear anymore. It was hard to stay on track this week. There were several times when I had to force myself to remember to log what I was eating. That was a hard week. I have never climbed a rock wall. We've never done it. Woo! 
It is about choices. It is about willpower. It is about discipline, making a decision, and making it happen. If I can do this, you can do this. It appears that keto was the answer that I was looking for that has finally brought me to a point uh, of success. Two more pounds in week 19. Uh, I am now under 220. My original goal was to get to 215. I'm almost there. As a great poet once said, I'm gonna check myself before I wreck myself. This is it. I have reached 215 pounds. Exactly. Which is nuts. A lot of what I do is kind of built in now. It's, my brain's kind of rewired towards this new lifestyle. And so you can see the time lapse of my neck and my face going like this and getting smaller. And uh, mostly I want to see that for myself, to be honest with you. And, and watch that scale go from 269 all the way down to 215. Um, it just feels good. It feels exciting.